Welcome back, family. Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Sir Loco187, coming at you with another banger. Beautiful day. Today is uh, March 4th. You already know what dropped today, the UNC Fives. Drop a comment if uh, y'all took a W or if y'all passed. So I'm right here to pick up a, a pair at my favorite store, my favorite boutique. So they said they had a, uh, an extra size available. So anyway, I'll come and holler at y'all here in a little bit later. Sheesh. Shout out to the local boutique store. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll catch up with y'all in, in a bit. I got uh, I did get a W at Shoe Palace, so that's where I'm going to get my W at Shoe Palace. This was just something extra unexpected. I'll let y'all in a minute. All right, y'all. So I'm uh, here at my next location, picking up my W from uh shoe palace so man beautiful day out today so i'm hoping you and your family are doing good doing well okay thank you for uh walking with your boy and growing with your boy okay definitely appreciate y'all so taking taking y'all with me on a journey today so i'll let y'all in a little bit later yes sir Shout out JD Sports. I got some uh, Panda, Panda, Panda. Where you at, Murder BX? Where you at? Go to your local JD. They got Panda restocks. Sheesh. Next place is uh, it's down there. Y'all can't see it, but I'm heading there to pick up my W. Shoe Palace, that little red sign over there. So I'll be there in a little bit. All right, family. So we're back at the lab. Oh, man, just a brief recap. Okay, I did hit in the Shoe Palace in-store raffle, and I hit on the Sneaker Politics online raffle, okay? And then I stopped at the local boutique, shout out to Center, and I copped another pair. Uh, both of those pairs that I'm about to review are accounted for, so I hit a total of three pairs. So real quick, for those of y'all that have been watching me, I always talk about networking, okay? About Facebook groups and networking. So anyways uh the guy I, I met before he was interested in a pair he was like well if you get a pair go ahead and uh go ahead and uh grab it you know what i'm saying so i got lucky and grabbed his otherwise it would just been me and uh, i ended up copying a pair for my co-worker so it's all good the price tag is 225 they did not have kid sizes if i'm not mistaken and as as if y'all like y'all saw in earlier in the video they had uh panda restocks that's right panda restocks your boy stays cooking in the kitchen y'all these bad boys sheesh so go 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 hit up your local jd sports see if they got them in your area okay so that's what i cop today is the panda panda express and your boy got these two pairs plus like the other one uh from sneaker politics which i never hit on a raffle online raffle i hit so that'll be my pair coming through the mail hopefully in about another week or so so here it is this is the main ingredient, y'all. The Air Jordan UNC5. Sheesh. Man, their Jordan brand was taxing. It, was it worth the 225? I don't know. I know. Uh, there goes my, my little uh, uh, winning tag there from Shoe Palace. Shout out to Shoe Palace and Center Boutique once again. And, you know, we're going to go over it. Okay, probably why they, they taxed 225, but. Uh, for those of us uh, that wanted these, I mean, I'd rather pay 225 than pay resale. You know what I'm saying? They're like in the mid to upper 200s. I don't know. As, as of this recording, I haven't really looked yet. But I know the bigger sizes, man, they're, 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 they're selling like hotcakes. So these are probably reached 300 if they're not already. Or they will pretty soon, in my opinion. But I could be wrong. But anyway, UNC. Michael Jordan went to the University of North Carolina, y'all. This is a Tinker Hatfield creation. Um, man, we'll start off with the tongue. You got that 3M reflective tongue and a black Jumpman uh, embroidery. You got that uh, clear plastic, uh, not plastic, but rubber netting, if you will, on the, on the tongue. You got flat uh, baby blue laces. And the Jordan 5s are known for good materials and it feels like a new buck okay new buck new buck suede new buck suede y'all so man it comes with very good materials and uh as you can see you got the shark teeth here with the 
with the with the what you call it with the paint splatter right there uh, modeled after a p51 uh world war ii fighter jet you got the netting on the lateral okay and you also have the same deal on the medial okay so i know a lot of people were probably iffy about it especially with the price point and also too with the back tag here which I, it doesn't bother me if you look at it all the pe's have this uh back tab if you will so it doesn't bother me at all whatsoever you know so you have the jumpman there team jordan you got quality products inspired by the greatest basketball player ever as you can see in the back okay and man look at this now the inside sock liner is is, is different now they did a similar uh material or similar pattern on the air jordan 13 soul flies and uh air jordan 5 uh dj cali we the best you know what i'm saying that's probably why the price point is is higher you know what i'm saying so anyway let me uh put one of these pairs down okay and like i said your boy for those of y'all that don't know jordan did not start on the starting fire for the unc fives okay he he earned his spot he played off the bench and that infamous uh, ncaa uh tournament game uh, uh which is march madness which is uh you know what i'm saying we're in march is for those of y'all that have been collecting sneakers for a while you already know like in march uh jordan j drops a unc colorway of a silhouette last year was the unc sixes which i do have and so anyway and the championship game was in 1982 if i'm not mistaken i could be off a year or two but uh, excuse me um michael jordan had the ball with like 20 seconds to go and he made a jump shot to win the game y'all so your boy mj been clutch i mean he missed a lot of shots but hey he made a lot of clutch shots too as well so man the materials feel good okay let's take a look at the inside of the box okay now i love that okay matches the jays you got a unc jump man okay let's get with the size air jordan 5 retro sc special edition university blue black and white okay and the bottom half of the box as you can see has a university uh blue paint splatter all throughout the box okay let's see if there's any stamp action yeah there is stamp action you got the uh paint splatter paper and you got the ydm okay so anyway i love when that happens we're going to take a look on the inside of the shoe all right y'all so anyway like i said i forgot to uh mention the infamous lace lock okay and i like how it's uh kind of it well it is translucent but it's kind of like the university of blue and then like the end it gets lighter if you will my camera probably does it no justice now you do have a jump man there on the side hopefully my camera catches it and on the other side there's uh nothing but i like how they blend the lace lock in there pretty dope if you ask me but i love the air jordan 5 because it definitely gives that old school 90s vintage vibes you know what i'm saying tinker hatfield his creation is still on and popping to this very day you know what i'm saying so let's get to the uh outsole okay you have the translucent icy outsole the jump man on the bottom you got jordan you got icy on the heel all right you got the exposed air air bubble unit on both sides as you can see man so i'm digging it man good good materials good materials overall and like i mentioned about the 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 insoles y'all see it now check this out sheesh okay check out it's got a pattern to it if y'all can see it pretty dope in my opinion pretty dope extra little touch so now i can see why you know what i'm saying that the 225 uh uh price point you know what I'm saying? They added some extra stuff. This is a dream cell, y'all. Dream cell. Yes, sir. So the actually, you know what I'm saying? The insoles are pretty dope. Inside sock liner, pretty dope with that material. The suede feels good. New buck. So, and then the box, they match the box. So, is it worth it? You know what I'm saying? I'm always going to say no. Ain't nothing worth anything. It's, it's uh, <laughs> priced at, but... I'd rather pay uh, the 225 
than uh, pay resale. Like I said, it's going more above uh, retail. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I guess it is what it is. I guess it is worth it, I guess. You know what I'm saying? So I am excited and delighted. Your boy's always excited and delighted when he could bring y'all some J's to review some J's, especially some dope J's. Okay, so anyway, that's the main ingredient. The Air Jordan 5 UNC colorway. All right. And uh, man, you know your boy can't cook without a special ingredient. That's every single one of y'all that's taking time out of your day to watch my video. So if y'all made it to the end of the video, please hit that thumbs up. Turn on your notification bell so when your boy Sir Loco is cooking in the kitchen, y'all be the first ones to come and get it. And if y'all haven't subscribed yet, by all means, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to the hottest channel around. Peace.